Details are inappropriate to detail, but in one, the Premier League chief executive talks of female irrationality, while women are described in derogatory language. A former girlfriend is referred to as a double-decker bus. He says you could play upstairs, but not down below. It's now been revealed that prior to publication of the story, Scudamore wrote to club chiefs asking them to judge if they believed the content was sexist and inappropriate. Until yesterday, I thought he might be able to ride it if he apologised properly. But now, especially given the revelation about his email to the chairman, I think his position is untenable. In a statement, Mr Scudamore said, these were private emails which should not have been accessed. I accept the contents are inappropriate and apologise for any offence caused. It was an error of judgement that I will not make again. England goalkeeper Rachel Brown Finnis has played 82 times for her country and today she told me that the controversy has implications that go well beyond the game. It's not just about women who are involved in the football industry or the sports industry or women in sport. It's really, it was an insult to all women, uh, those jokes that were made. And, and however jokey he was trying to be with that, it, it's just totally unacceptable in this, in this day and age. That's a view that's shared by many here at the grassroots, where women's and girls' football is increasingly popular.